I'm Dominic Moreno, I'm a pitcher and I am a senior. As soon as I came into Tech, I tried to, we got in the weight room and did all that and guys like Andre Wheeler and Trey Massig, Jared McCrumman, those are those are three guys that really stick in my head. Uh, I, I automatically went and worked out with Trey Massig and Jared. Like they were the biggest workout guys out of the pitchers and they welcomed me with open arms. That's really where this whole tech thing, that's where the, we kind of, our success started. Even though we weren't very good our sophomore year and we struggled a little bit, that's where everything started because those guys led us in the right direction. Two of the leaders for our team would be, for the pitching, would be me and Corey Taylor. You know, we like to lead by example a lot. Corey Taylor's a, well, just like I said, a great example of that. I mean, he does everything right. He does everything the right way. And um, I, like to, I like to try to do the same thing. And we're also seniors, so everyone kind of respects us and looks up to us. If we need a vocal leader, I'm sure none of the fans would be surprised to see that, uh, that I would be the vocal leader type thing if I need to get on someone, which doesn't happen much. We got a great group of guys. Or if I need to just you know push someone in the right direction, I think uh, that's more of where I come in. But I guess that all came from, you know, you just got to keep the energy up throughout the whole game. Throughout however many games that is, that's a lot of games. And, you know, it's hard to keep up every single day, but I like to take it upon myself to show everyone, show, show everyone that goes out there and pitches that I'm out there, that I care about them, that uh, they're, they're going to be the first guys that I tell good job when they're done. And, you know, it's a, it's a team game, so everyone needs to know they're a part of the team, and I like to let everyone know that. And, um, if everyone knows that they're needed, then then you're going to be automatically a better team. It's hard. It's hard. I guess if you go, if you win 10 games in a season, you're like, hey, everybody, do this, do that. I mean, I don't know. I haven't ever been in that situation though. So I guess success helps knowing that we've done it before, and that I've been here, Corey's been here, Ryan Mosley's been here, even though he's young. Dylan Dushek's been here. Um, all those guys have a say in everything. Um, we all have a say. It's not. This isn't a. This is an autocracy. This is a democracy. So. It's, it's something that we, we, uh, we, we know we had success and they know that we also were part of it. I guess it goes back to me uh, telling the pitchers, like, good job every inning. Until I go down in the bullpen, I'm going to be out there. Um, unless I'm in the bullpen, I'm in the dugout. If I haven't pitched, then, and we hit a walk-off like that, I'm just as excited as anybody else. And I'm going to go out there, I'm going to lift them up, I'm going to be like, I'm going to be excited just like, just like anybody. So maybe I just showed a little bit different, maybe a little flamboyant, but that's all right, I don't care. Um, uh, wins like that are pretty pretty important wins. Not they're not just a win. Like that's a that's an emotion building win. That's a that's a season. That's that those are the type of wins that can turn a season around. Obviously, you have games like if we remember the ACU game here. It just everything was just inning was going by. Everything was going by, and we couldn't get any hits. They couldn't get any hits. It just seemed like the game was going to last forever. Um, that's when it's hard to really be talking and talking and talking and talkative. But it's. You gotta always, you know, a guy comes out, ground ball, shortstop, not a good AB. You know, hey, listen, you're gonna get another AB. You're gonna help the team. Like, you gotta, you gotta stick it because you gotta go back out there on defense. Um, it's just little stuff like that. Like, don't take your at bat to defense. Don't take your defense to your at bat. Um, that helps win games. It's just one, one ball bouncing one way or the other is the difference in an extra inning game. So, and we we all know that, and they need to know that. I'm a guy who. Um, who hasn't had all the talent in the world my whole life. You know, I've worked really hard to get where I'm at, and I think Texas Tech is really the embodiment of work hard. We don't have all the talent in the world. We didn't have all the talent in the world last year, but we were a great team, we were a family. Everybody needs to work hard, and everybody needs to put in their effort. And um, this, team, this team could be great going forward for the five next, next five, ten years.